What's in the box? Welcome to another episode of What's in the Box. I am your host, GQ. Do me a favor. Hit the subscribe button. I can't go to Germany. Why? I, I got homework. Like the video, leave some comments on this video and the other ones that I've done. Share the video, spread some of that culture junkies love around the world. And make sure to you know, hit us up on Twitch and check out our show that we do on Wednesday. And you know what, we'll talk about some of that later. Let's get to what we are here for today. So we've got the Marvel Studios Marvel Legends, Avengers Endgame, slash Infinity Saga, slash Sony's got part ownership or main, you know, whatever. We got a Spider-Man helmet here with uh, some really cool features to it. So, you know what? Let's open it up, see what's inside. All right, one of these sides has a panel. Yeah, tape, yep, of course there's tape. Came prepared today, no grabbing a blade sword or any other extra thing today, fortunately. I remember to bring the X-Acto knife to the table today. So, let's see what we got here. Okay, cardboard as always. Pretty straightforward. And looks like I'm seeing some instructions in there. Normally I wouldn't even bother with the instructions, but these helmets can get a little uh, little interesting when it comes to what you should and shouldn't do with them. So well, I'm gonna play it safe. Spend enough money on this thing where I honestly don't wanna break it. Get in there. All right, not too bad. Get you out of the way. Plastic. Okay, not too bad. Obviously modeled after, after the uh, Iron Spider style look that he had, of course, in Infinity War and um, also in um, Endgame, of course. First showed up in the MCU, though, in Spider-Man Homecoming. First time we got to see the Iron Spider uh, armor or suit, but of course he didn't put it on right then and there. He told Tony that he wanted to just go ahead and remain being a friendly neighborhood Spider-Man. And of course that left Tony with the uh, arduous task of proposing to Pepper Potts because hey, he brought out a press con big uh, press announcement so you gotta have something to say. So, I won't get into that because you know, hey, it is what it is. I wouldn't have done that. All right, so gotta put some batteries in this thing. There is a battery compartment hidden in front of his head? Seriously? Well, that's interesting. Okay, battery compartment's at the front. That's different. That's too big. Let's see. That's what she said. But, uh, yeah. All in all, uh, I've been really pleased with Tom Holland's performance as Spider-Man. Some people uh, disagree and think that he's not quite a good Spider-Man. I, I, I like him. I, I thought he did a good job as uh, Peter Parker and as Spider-Man. It's one of the few times he actually got a high school age kid, at least when he first started, to actually be a high school age character. Wow. I guess I'm allowed to remember one thing, because apparently I left my batteries on the other side of the room. Well, that kind of sucks. All right, let's uh, let's get that. Let's go take care of that. Got to have those. A few moments later. And through the power of editing, we're back. God, we left the batteries sitting on the other side of the room. Well, guess you can't win them all. Got that there. Hmm. Okay, huh. so a couple of different things going to be going on, I guess, during each time you hit the power button. Seven different things. That's pretty interesting. All right, well, 
gotta get rid of these because apparently not the easiest thing to have those on underneath here. Let's put this on and see what we've got. Find that separation. Oh, split some two points. This at the back and also front to back. So it's pretty cool. Makes it easier to put on. I guess at some point you're gonna cooperate with me. I'm just gonna shove my head in there. How about that. Oh wow. <laughs> the view from in here is really uh, interesting. So now power button is there. Okay, so each one does something different, I think. Oh yeah, they have red eyes. I wish they had something to simulate the instant kill, but the red eyes is pretty cool. Yep, so each one does little slight adjustments here and there. I think I might actually have to turn the lights off so you get a better idea. Yep, you know what, I think I can why not? Power of editing. Let's do it again. Later that same evening. Well, one thing I can definitely say. This thing gets pretty foggy. But. So I can't really truly see what you guys are seeing, but let me cycle through. This looks like that's off. Full on blue. Slightly dimmer, slightly dimmer. Full on red. Slightly dimmer, slightly dimmer. And back to off. Very cool, actually. Yeah. Let's go with that red. But yeah, I'm not gonna do the rest of the video in the dark. It'd be kind of cool, but I'm not gonna do the rest of the video in the dark. So let's get these lights back up real quick, and we'll uh, rely on the power of editing one last time. 346 minutes later. So yeah, that was the Marvel Legends uh, in Infinity Saga slash Endgame Iron Spider Spider-Man helmet with a uh, light up eyes and features. Um, not too bad. I mean, it's, you know, it is what it is. It's a, it's a helmet similar to the other ones that I have that you may have seen in the unboxings for or you may have just seen when I show pictures of the, the massive collection that I have. But all in all, not too bad. Pretty much worth it, you know, Marvel Legends usually puts out really good stuff. And speaking of really good stuff, I wanna give some shout outs to our amazing Patreons, Culture Junkies level and above. Starting with Demarcus Smith, Fab Nerd Life, Nanette Net, The Iguana Man, and The Other Steve. We appreciate you guys supporting us through Patreon. And if you would like to support us on Patreon, go to patreon.com slash culture junkies. For as little as a dollar a month, you can support a culture junkie. Uh, we appreciate the support however it comes in, whether it be through likes, love, shares, comments on the video, as well as um, you know sh sharing our content with your friends. So once again, for the Marvel Legends Infinity Saga, Avengers Endgame, Iron Spider, Spider-Man Helmet, I'm GQ, and I'll see you guys next time.